welcome to iGym Uppsala. I'm Teresa and I'm going to give you a tour of the fabulous town of Uppsala. Uppsala is the fourth largest city in Sweden and houses 25,000 students from all across the world. Uppsala is also very famous for many alums such as Nobel Prize winners Carl von Linné as well as, as well as the Archbishop of Sweden lives here. Now as it's getting very hot here on the roof, come with me and I'm going to give you the tour of the university building where the majority of students should be spending most of their days. Uppsala University is the oldest university in Scandinavia that dates back to the 15th century and is a very nice building. Uppsala has also very many nice nature areas including Stadspark where we are now where generally uh, young people come and drink booze stolen from their parents. garden where Carl von Linnea spent most of his time playing with flowers and ants. Donations of local watering hole for all students. They're like the fraternities of Sweden where students with common interests get together and arrange dinners, drama clubs and even study circles. Or to even party. <laughs> At the nations everything is subsidized for students. Food. Fika. And alcohol. Kira, it's my show! Everything is subsidized, subsidized, subsidized. Everything is subsidized for the students of Uppsala. One of Uppsala's most famous landmarks is the Fyrus River. The Fyrus River of Uppsala is the greatest source of bicycles. As the quickest way to get around Uppsala and also most efficiently is by bike, as students normally have a very tight economy to get a new bike, just patiently throw your hook in the river and wait for a bike to bite. All jokes aside, it's a tradition for newly arrived students to fish a bike out of the river. How they got there in the first place, no one knows! Unfortunately, our tour is cut a bit short by a sudden downpour. Nevertheless, the Fittest River is not only famous for its amount of bicycle, but also the annual river rafting, which is hosted every year from students of Uppsala University. <laughs> Basically, representatives from all different fields of study are given some styrofoam, some paint and a lot of duct tape to create an aesthetically very attractive floating device. Although, I should warn you, it is a very, very dangerous rafting. Only true Vikings survive. <laughs> the river rafting event is part of an all-Swedish, all-student holiday called Valborg. Valborg for Swedes involves pickled herring as well as bonfires. However, Valborg for Uppsala students involves alcohol, river rafting, Herring and again alcohol. <laughs> However, we will take us to our next destination on our tour, which you can see in the background just now. Another great landmark is the Cathedral of Uppsala. <laughs> church houses the tomb of the great king Gustav Vasa, which is basically Sweden's Henry VIII, along with church pillaging and multiple wives. Gustav Vasa is also the inventor of Swedish knäckebröd, as well as the dollar horse. Thank you, I hope you enjoyed our tour of Uppsala. I hope you'll join us next time when we have a lab tour of our fabulous team waiting for you. Like us on our Facebook page, iGem Uppsala. Thank you. Everything is subsidized for the students of Uppsala. Everything is subsidized, subsidized, subsidized. Everything is subsidized for the students of Uppsala. Hey ho, let's go! Hey ho! <laughs>